Okay, how's everyone doing today? This is another video, second one today because I'm getting really bored. Today I'm going to show you, if you know about soup worms, how to breed them. So first thing you need to know is you need to have the soup worm. So one thing I learned was, um, soup worm, when I, when I got my first beetle, I was really freaked out. So you're probably watching this video because you got some soup worms and you want to make lots of them, right? So right here's my soup worm. Most of them. Some are in there, but not many. And so, how do I get these guys to turn to, be to pupa to the beetle? So, how do you get them to turn into a pupa? Is they need a dark and coldish, warmish, like sort of what my basement's in right now. They need a darker environment. And then they might just dig under and sit there and curl up. They're not dead, they're turning into a pupa. So, some people take, like, I don't even know how to explain it, but they're, like, it's like a tackle box, sort of. It's like a big box with a bunch of cuts in it, with a bunch of, like, dividers in it. And some people just take them and put one in each, and a little bit of carrot or something, until they turn into a pupa, then a beetle. I have three pupas, two beetles. I think the one beetle died, but I'm not sure. If you watch my reptile room tour... These guys were in it. Um, are you are you alive? I'm alive. He's good. So, let me just put that back. In here, I have one pupa, one beetle hanging on the grass. I think he's eating grass. I'm not sure. So here, so I have a couple of people here. He's getting ready to turn. He or she is getting ready to turn into a beetle. So. What I learned was, um, I had an adult tank, and it had, like, tool-friendly, um, like, stuff on the bottom. I don't, what's it called? Like, I keep forgetting. But, it had, like, this dirt. It was, like, loose mulch and dirt. And I put some in. I put, like, three in. And a couple week, a couple of days, a few days later, I look in, and I saw a beetle. I was like, holy crap, how'd that get there? And then I looked under and I saw all the shedded skin, and then I realized that's how you do it. So since then, I've been putting these guys in a dark place, and that's my goal now. I'm trying to get this. Who's over there? Oh, my cat. I'm trying to get this to turn into dirt. And then I can use that dirt to throw some of these guys in there. And then I'll have beetles, so that's how you do it. If you want more videos, I mean, more videos on this, Say something in the comments, anything that you guys want to see more of. Thanks for watching, like, subscribe, type a comment with your nose, and have a good one.